Thursday, so that means it's time for another edition of Ask Ellen. So here's a look at today's question. John from Lowell sent us a picture and says, I was wondering how the swirl effect of the clouds could be mixed with what I would call a normal looking cloud. Ellen. I love this. I love the cloud identification questions that we get, and this one is a little special, and so I figured we would tackle this one for today's Ask Ellen. So what you see here is the normal-looking cloud. This is also known as just a plain old cumulus cloud. Cumulus clouds grow in the sky, especially in the afternoon, and this is the cloud in question. So hopefully you can see it. It's like a stretched-out cloud, and it has a swirl to it. So attached to the cloud in question, we have our normal cumulus cloud. So remember with me that cumulus clouds are special. They're the only clouds to grow in the sky. All other clouds grow horizontally or laterally, but cumulus clouds grow vertically. So depending on where they start, they'll keep their bases there and then they'll just continue to grow vertically into the sky. So what's interesting is sometimes you can see clouds at different levels. So let's say we have a beautiful day and you can see clouds already out there at a different layer. If you get a new cumulus cloud to form, it can push up on a second cloud, creating what's called a pileus cloud. So if you see this in the sky, it looks like a normal cloud, a cumulus cloud, but it has this special cap to it. Usually it has swirls because it's being impacted by the growing cloud below, stretched and occasionally sheared by the winds. But bottom line, pileus clouds, they're just clouds that were sitting in a spot and got pushed up. It almost is like a, a hat on another cloud. So there we go. That's there the, you the go. bottom line definition. I love it. <laughs> a little hat on the cloud. All right, thanks, Ellen.